I definitely think that Salem is prepared to deal with this character. Oh, oh my god, <laughs> early grenades and uh, it's like a boom boom, let's get into the game. Salem opening up strong. But of course Snake, the the rap on Snake is just, once you get Snake in the air and haven't played disadvantage, it could be trouble. Yeah, Salem's already starting off super strong. He's like having the setups everywhere, the bombs to follow up into his aerials, great beer versus positioning. Like that's the one thing yeah. I noticed about all these top snakes like MVD, Ally, uh, Salem, they use their grenades in a, oh my goodness, perfect stock with the C4. Yeah, does he have a hurt box? Like, he has not been hit. Okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah. They, they use their grenades not necessarily to just throw them at you, but to make you move in a way that they want you to. And then they follow it from there. It's really interesting to see. And it's definitely hard to get around because no other character in the game plays like Snake does. Yeah, he controls so much space with the grenades. And you saw that one ledge exchange. It looked like Fish had absolutely nowhere to go. So, yeah, just a difficult time, especially those that are unfamiliar with the matchup. Especially one, a snake of this caliber with all the setups, it's just n not a good time overall. He's already oh, in trouble. Oh man, that'll pick him off. <laughs> so good. Salem is controlling the stage so well. Like, it's really hard for him to get in with this Lucina and actually get started. I know if Lucina does, you know, get snake in the air, she can juggle really well, but Salem's not even been put in a situation like that. Look at the beer versus positioning as well, too. Yeah, he's just not made a mystery the entire game. Like, everything is working for him. Doesn't matter what button he's hitting, it's doing damage. Oh, scary position there at the top platform. You don't want to get put in a spot where you can just get down thrown up there. Very easy to get a tech chase. Yeah, it really looks like the Cena player just trying to get around the grenades, but every time he swings a button, he's blowing up. Yeah, it's kind of like every time he can navigate the grenades, Salem's right there. Anytime he can figure out Salem, all the grenades are there. There's an up there, and that'll take the game. Yeah, I just, you know, sometimes you get caught in the moment. You're playing against a legendary player, and the spotlight hits, and it's 3-2-1 yeah. go, and you get a little petrified. It's a little tentative in that game, I think. Yeah, that is another fact you got to consider when you're at a tournament with all these top players. You can definitely, like you said, get in your own head because, you know, you're dealing with someone that's well-known. You know they're super good. And uh, honestly, you just kind of have to, you have to have that confidence when you go into this game. Like, no matter who you're playing, you can do well. Yeah, sometimes it's about just catching them off guard, come out swinging and hit them hard and see if they're able to adapt. So let's see if Fish can play a little more aggressively and control a little bit more stage. Because the way he's playing, the tentativeness, it's allowing Salem to set up everything. And so far, it's just picking up where he left off. And they're going into it. Salem, so far, he's taking about half the damage the last game. So maybe uh, Fish doing a little bit better. Salem looks so comfortable, moving so well. The snake right here, all those setups so hard to get past the explosions, man. The thing about Snake is so interesting to me is that he can ledge trap you from halfway across the stage. Yeah. I don't think any other character can do that. It's just, you know, control so much space, especially when they have all the momentum. Oh, um, man. It's just right where he left off. Oh, my God. Hey, Salem, oh, take it easy. He's just a boy. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, Salem's definitely feeling himself right now. <laughs> it's like it's prime time. Oh, oh my god, that call almost combo. <laughs> yeah, his setups are crazy, bro. Almost getting the grenade to explode right into the forward smash. Yeah, Snake's one of the characters, man. If you have like everything planned out and you're doing your moves for a reason, not necessarily just throwing them out willy-nilly, he's uh, <laughs> so crazy. There it is again, making that dare safe because the grenade is right next to his shield. He just sitting there playing off the platforms off stage. Not something you typically you typically see from snakes. All right, again with the ledge trap at the grenade right where he wants him. Trying to see if he can bait a jump, maybe go for an up air and an up tilt. Yeah, it just kind of seems like Nikita. Fish has been off stage oh, the entire game. Oh my goodness, the deadly not, Nikita. <laughs> yeah, not really ever able to play neutral. Just grenades and every time he gets set up, it's rough. Oh, last hit in there, connecting another parry into the forward tilt, into the C4. Yeah, Salem's firing on all cylinders right now. Ooh. Yeah, it doesn't matter uh, at this point. He's built up such a much lead. It's kind of uh, just, he's working on his combo video at this point. Yeah, I love it. I love the Z drops, the beer versus, just putting the grenades in all these tricky spots. So difficult to really just read where he's going to go next. You have to worry about this Nikita too. Yeah, and that should do it. Yeah, there you go. Salem commanded victory. Yeah.
That was a six stock, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, definitely the first one was a uh, three stock.